take my throne, but none have succeeded. I'm still the king of my throne with my mighty sword. I take the lives of those who begrudge me my kingdom. Now, the things I do for these videos. And hey, you guys gotta give a serious thumbs up for that intro, right? I mean, that was just some awesome shiznick. Now, Today, we're going to be showing you the Throne Industrial, hence the funny makeup and all the crazy stuff. I was kind of going for like the you know, movie Priest, like the Priest, not quite Judas Priest, but you know, that'd be cool too. Got the leather vest going, but nope, today we're here to bring you the Throne Industrial. That's right. Inside of it, whew, three GTX 680s in SLI. Incredible. 3970X from the people over at Intel and also on an Intel motherboard, also 48 gigabytes that's right 48 gigabytes of kingston hyperx beast memory so you know this is just one totally bad ass system so now the main focus of this build is the case let's jump in all right so check it out right here at the front of the system you guys can see it's incredible right in the front door you see there's a power meter that shows the voltage of the system this is trippy plus the only way to turn the system on is by a key you actually have to insert a key turn it and that's the way you start the system just really kind of crazy stuff now we'll go around to the side you guys can see it says the throne industrial this thing was made by bob from bs mods up in washington state that's right thanks a lot bob now this thing has total modded out fans as well all these fans that we see here on top they are completely actually industrial level fans. And if you guys can hear the thing running, you know exactly what I mean. This thing sounds honestly like a jet plane getting ready to take off or maybe in flight, your choice. But it's really, really, really loud. And if you put your fingers through, these fans will slice your fingers off. There is no protection whatsoever. Now, as far as like all the mods, there's quite a bit of stuff going on. Real quick, we'll take a look at the back of the system. You know, there's not really too much there. Now, with the door on, you can see the other side matches up with once again saying the throne industrial. But if you pull the door off, that's where things start getting very, very interesting. Now, you guys can see this thing is totally modded out inside to look like, you know, something industrial. You guys can also see inside of the system, there is custom Swift Tech cooling throughout the system. Swift Tech is entirely cooling this system. The case is also the Rosewill case. It's the Rosewill throne, which has been totally modified out to become what you see here, the throne industrial. Now, check it all out. It's all custom lit. Everything inside the system just looks awesome. So there you guys have it, the Throne Industrial, sponsored by Rose Will and hand-built and custom done by Bob Stewart of BS Mods, who, by the way, is also making a case for us here on Tech of Tomorrow, so that should be really awesome. It's going to be the Blue Thunder. You guys will love it. Now, like usual, we don't list every single solitary thing in the video because some people feel that's too tedious, but if you're a person who wants to see every single solitary part, everything that Bob did in the mods, you guys can check that out in the link in the description below, or you guys can check on it right here next to me on the screen. So hey, you guys know you have to like this video. This thing was really awesome. Make sure you guys hit that like button. You know what I mean? Hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed, you guys want to make sure you do so because Rozo is also sponsoring, along with Gigabyte and a few of our other people, a 100K contest, and you guys don't want to miss out on that. So if you're not sub, make sure you do so. We'll see you guys back here on Tech of Tomorrow for more Thrones and Goodness.